Hi everyone, welcome back to the Worldwide Vaccine Series. Now in this series, I would periodically update you guys with different types of vaccines that may or may not be available in the US. Now this second episode, we are going to talk about this vaccine. I believe it is called PsychoVD. PsychoVD COVID vaccine is the world's first plasmid DNA vaccine authorized for use to prevent COVID-19. It is indigenously developed by the Indian company Caldilla Healthcare. This is a three-dose vaccine for children above 12 years old and adults of all ages. Plasmid DNA is a small ring of DNA that contains genetic information. It is a non-replicating and non-integrating plasmid that carries the SARS-CoV-2 virus spike protein gene. The vaccine is designed to transfer the plasmid DNA into the nucleus of the cell. The plasmid is then transcribed into mRNA and ultimately translated into the spike proteins. The spike protein can either be displayed on the muscle cells or secreted to stimulate both a cellular immune response, that in terms leading to B cell stimulation and antibody immune responses. The vaccine is also unique in that it is needle-free and is injected through two layers of the skin using a spring-powered jet injector. The Phase 3 clinical trial data reported the vaccine is 66.6% .6 effective against symptomatic COVID-19 and is 100% effective against moderate or severe diseases, and the company reported the vaccine is well tolerated. The main advantages of this vaccine is number one, low cost to manufacture, number two, fast to manufacture, and three, stable at room temperature. This is because DNA is naturally thermostable and easy to synthesize chemically. The main disadvantage is the relative low efficiency in delivering the plasmid DNA into the nucleus, and that may be the reason for its three dose requirement. So far, this vaccine PsychoVD is only available in India and there's no news about its availability anywhere else in the world. In our next episode, I'm going to give an update on some of the nasal COVID vaccines that are in clinical trial. So stay tuned and I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.